What's up watchers, Will here with another Godzilla Kong video for you, and today we are exploring our options again and looking at what possible films could kick off a phase 2 for the legendary monsterverse. Now we have Kong who so far is the only non-Toho and non-original creation from Legendary Pictures in King of the Monsters who will also be introduced to the American reimaginings of Mothra, Rodan, and King Ghidorah. You would think having Kong get a sequel would be the first step, but I think having him fight on his own turf and then having him fight Godzilla in probably what's going to be more than likely a city, you may have exhausted all the stories you can tell for that character from a human's perspective. Now, if you want to do a story from Kong's perspective, about him maybe discovering somewhere he is not the last of his species and he has to go on a journey and maybe fight the Icarus Tigris, that could be something but that could also be a bit of a stretch. I honestly think the antithesis to the first Godzilla film would be to bring back Ghidorah and do a Monster X film. Now, I don't know what they're going to do with the character in either King of the Monsters or the Versus film, but with each new kaiju seemingly being more of a super species of animal, I think we could get the story of Ghidorah. Make it a villain's rising film where you see the contrast of young prehistoric Ghidorah and maybe have a few young Godzilla cameos, but show how he became so feared by man and how modern society will deal with him presumably without Godzilla. Although judging by the Oxygen Destroyer teaser, we may have an idea. Maybe in the end, Mothra defeats him and that would be a good way to market the character because as cool as I think she is, I don't think Mothra would sell a solo for American audiences particularly well. So this way you could cloak her in and make her the hero, make Adora the villain and call it Monster X with no Godzilla. Next, I think you can do your return film and after having to do a sequel to Kong and a spin-off, you get Godzilla 3. That focuses on him taking on a man-made cyborg creation known as Gigan, and maybe if you're bold enough, find a way to work an egg in there. Just use the old asexual reproduction method and the plot is of Godzilla learning to balance compassion with rage and maybe counter that with a human story about the complicated relationship between a parent and a child. You can work in Kiryu too and have it be built on the bones of a deceased Godzilla from the past and this can give our Godzilla some conflict because it sounds like him but it doesn't look or act like him. Finally, to cap it off, I think you do your enemy of my enemy type film. Maybe not aliens per se, but some evil kaiju or looming threat makes it necessary for all the kaiju to team up. Maybe you get a monster war film, and it forces Godzilla and Ghidorah, sworn enemies, to put aside their differences and hatred for one another to go up against a common threat. Who knows, maybe it'll be something crazy like Cthulhu, like a lot of people have suggested down in the comment section. It's doubtful, but that would be something funny if they went that far to do it. You have enemies team up to win the day because they realize if they don't, they'll die. Then at the end they fight each other and these can be your end pieces for a lot of old characters and some kaiju and maybe have this be a backdoor way to produce an Earth Defense Force film. But these are just my ideas for how to attempt a second phase of the MonsterVerse. Let me know how you would handle it down in the comments below, or if you think it should all stop after 2020's Godzilla vs. Kong. Also, while you're at it, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to Hybrid Network. I'm Will, and I'll see you next time.